We're here at uh, 1522 Meads Street. You can see you have some very nice landscaping in the front there. Uh, this is a, a dead-end unit, um, so you don't have to worry about any through traffic. Uh, real nice little area, uh, real established. So you have a lot of parking spaces. Uh, and then you do have like this little garden area in the back uh, as well. But we'll head up here and, and take a look inside. Uh, this is actually the upstairs unit, so there's one below it. Uh, so this will be the upstairs condo here. And we'll take a glance up these stairs. Bear with me for just a moment. It's a real open layout. Um, we're currently in the process of getting rid of that couch there, but uh, really spacious. This is 2,400 square feet, uh, so it's huge. I hope you guys can grasp uh, the concept of just how big this place is. Um, really big space. I'll take a step over here so you guys can see. You actually have um, this nice marble um, uh, on the windows there. So you have a nice little view out there. A lot of natural light uh, coming in here. You can see just how big this space is. Um, really open floor plan though, so I really like that. So we come over here. You can see down the hallway. We'll get there in just a moment. You have these nice doors uh, to close off if you really wanted to. You have another door here uh, to close off right there as well. Sliding doors, one over here. Uh, here's the laundry room right here with uh, washer and dryer will be included. These are brand new. You guys can enjoy those. Nice uh, space for uh, do your laundry and everything. You have real open uh, kitchen there so you have a ceiling fan up there as well. Uh, you have your stove top and your oven straight ahead. Dishwasher, uh, your fridge off to the left. Uh, and straight over there, you do have, straight back, you do have a little storage space uh, straight back into the right over there. Down here, I'm just kind of going to aim this down so you guys can see, but you do have like a little patio area um, right there that uh, is shared with the downstairs neighbor and a nice little backyard. So. Uh, definitely nice. We'll take a glance over here. So this is actually uh, not considered a bedroom because it doesn't have a closet, but you can see still just how big this thing is. I mean, it's huge. A king-size bed can fit in here. Probably like three or four king-size beds can fit in here. It's abs absolutely huge. Excuse me. And uh, here, this is actually like a little wet bar area. So you have uh, this cool-looking window, some shelving to the left as well as to the right there. Uh, some additional storage space for uh, any liquor, I guess. And then you have, I'll show you guys, so you have like this little bar where you can close half the door. And if the bar is completely closed, you close the other half. So kind of fun there. Um, or you could use it as a closet, I guess, if somebody needed an additional uh, bedroom. Uh, heading down the hallway, um, the attic up here, this is off limits. So just to be clear with that. Um, and here you have this renovated bathroom. Uh, this is absolutely fantastic. They just finished this um, probably a couple weeks ago, and you have this tile all throughout. Um, big bathtub over here. Excuse me if I'm giving anybody a headache. Um, you do have like a little linen closet to go with this, and you can see it comes over here. And then of course a nice little um, you know cabinet, medicine mm -hmm. cabinet right there. Uh, you have a linen closet right here to the right, and one uh, right here as well. And here we have actually the first bedroom. Um, this again is absolutely huge. I hope you guys can grasp the concept of this, but it is, it is ginormous. Uh, and you have these really cool closets, uh, which is actually really big, built-in um, kind of dresser, I guess you could call it. But it goes back quite a ways, um, both directions there. And we'll head over real quick to the master bedroom. Um, my favorite bedroom in here, mainly because of the bathroom. They're finishing up just a couple things, so you can just excuse the leftover stuff there. Uh, you have your closet and a little sit-in table there. I hope you guys can see that. And it has, uh, that's actually a marble table, so really nice. But pretty decent sized closet. There's a linen closet right there to the right. And over here, as I mentioned, this is my favorite bathroom because of that. You have a jetted tub. And this thing is absolutely magnificent. I mean, this is right out of HGTV. I mean, this thing is fantastic. 
you have this amazing tile work done in here. Uh, and the jetted tub, uh, you can see with the sticker still on it, it's brand new. So uh, you can be the first to enjoy that, uh, as well as you have those knobs there so you can turn the jets up higher or lower, more bubbles, whatever your preference is. You have a brand new vanity, uh, nice looking toilet there, and then you have this built-in shelf, which I think is absolutely fantastic for that little custom shelf there. Store, you know, paper towels or little decorations or something candles, whatever it may be, but uh, absolutely fantastic house. Uh, this won't last long, so come fill out an application now. Thanks.